because it is nothing but Chaitanya and Chaitanya only free from all that is superimposed. Purna. This Purna, this word they are very familiar with. But to know exactly what is Purna is very difficult. What is Purna? Purna. Boom. Boom. Come here. Sunday Bhoja Pudu. Boom. No deficiencies. That there is no deficiency. Are you sorrowful? Do you become sorrowful? Yes or no? Prone to be, not that you are always, prone to be, deficiency or not, birth, deficiency or not, growth, childhood, deficiency or not, totally dependent on No, it really cannot take care of oneself also. As you go old age, I think it is a golden age. Old age is golden age. Ask old people. They will tell you. You know that? See, a grandson was looking at the towards the grandpa. Sitting in the easy chair and all that, etc. etc. He thought, how nice it would have been if I were the, the grandpa. And the grandpa looking at the grandson. See how jovial life. Running here and there and there. How nice it is. Bhagavan granted both moves. <laughs> grandson became the grandfather. <coughs> then they came to know what all problems are there. So like that, efficiency. Then don't ask at all. Efficiency or not? Sorrows. No, very well. Then, a state wherein nothing is, none of the objections are there, that is what person of us. It can be only Satchidananda Sarupa. Satchidananda. That is Chaitanya Sarupa, that is Atma Sarupa. Now he says, unless you identify with the body, you can't perceive the world. Do you perceive the world now? Yes. You are interacting with the world. It needs the identification with the body. If you don't identify, identification with the world, taking the body as I. If you don't take the body as I, even if we have the body, no jagat at all. Yat pancha koshan matamaski de am. Yat pancha koshan matamaski de am. Tadantara kim buanam chakasti. Tadantara kim buanam chakasti. De am vina pancha vidham tade tatu. Pashanti keva buanam anantu. Pashanti keva buanam anantu. Anvaya. Pancha kosha makam. Yat deham asti tad antara buanam chakasti kim. Tad antara buvanam chakasti kim tad etar pancha vidham deham vina ke va buvanam pashyanti vanantu. You have to identify with the body to perceive the jagat. Pancha kosha atmakam. 
Atmakam means Rupa. This body which has got the form or which is of the nature of five sheets. I hope you know what are the five sheets. Anandamaya Vatu, Anandamaya. Panchakoshatmakam, so yat whatever, deham asti. Whatever body of ours that is there, which has got five koshas, Annamaya, Pranamaya, Manomaya, Vidyanamaya, Anandamaya. Tadantara, Tad Vina, without that, you don't take, don't take into account the body. Tadantara, Bhuvanam Chakastiki, does the world appear to be there? Does the world, is the world perceived? How will you verify? What is, what is that? Without the body, you can't perceive the jagat. Presently, do you perceive the jagat or not? At what level? Two levels. What are those? Listening and seeing. Minimum expected. <laughs> so because you are in the class, you are supposed to listen. You can't close the eyes and this thing will doze off. Therefore what? You have to keep the eyes open. That is what? Or some people have. Some speakers have got the happy. <laughs> close the eyes and then. That is not the correct. See, you have to interact with the audience. From the eyes of the audience, you can make out <laughs> what, how much understood, how much has got above the head, how much has got below, below the head. All this you can, you have to interact, you should know. You should get a feedback. Otherwise, it is not that. University professor's lecture. Whether you understand or not, go. I will do my job and finish it. So you are listening. What is necessary for you to listen? Ears. Can the ears be just hanging like that? What is the body necessary? The body is necessary. What do you mean that mind is necessary? Mind is also what is necessary? Brain is necessary. It's the house of mind. Think of it. Your brain is open. <laughs> Neurosurgeon will have to go on. Someone immediately. Is it possible? Now, let me see. I must be there. Where are they? How to do In the body. So, without the physical body, you can't perceive the jagat, you can't interact with the Still, if you have got doubt, in sleep, is your body for you? Are you aware of the body? Still, some people hesitate. Okay? If you sleep, the body is nothing, what will happen to be afterward? What will happen to bank balance? <laughs> so what is that? So that is that. Are you aware of the body? Conscious of the body? This body is not for you. Afterwards you will be aware that at that time you are not aware of that. See? So then, at that time, do you perceive the world? No. In sleep, you are in deep sleep. Suppose there are some patients, they suffer from what, what they call somnambulism. You know somnambulism? Walking in the sleep. Uh, uh, this fellow packs up the bedsheet at night and start walking. And he's not aware of it. He's not aware of it. You have to bolt the door tightly, then you're not able to open it. Even at that time, what? Total awareness of the body is asked, hey, what are you doing? What? What are you doing? I don't know. 
It's not out of the body, but it's some defect, okay, some defect in the mental level. So in the sleep, we are not identified with the body. The body is not available. We don't perceive the body. In dream, we are identified with the subtle body. Physical body, we are not identified. We are identified with the subtle body. Therefore, that subtle world is there. Otherwise, say, love, suppose, you dream. And in the dream, Whatever. You took a flight to New York. And you woke up there. Where will be your body? <laughs> Suppose that you got to New York. One dollar is not One dollar is not Where are you going? No. And you woke up in the flight only. They say, get out. <laughs> so what will happen? Body must be there or not? Means your physical body is not a that was a dream body. Different. Even there also, what is necessary? Dream body is necessary. Without the body, you can't perceive the jagat, waking world or dream world. Sleep, both are not there. So that means Tadantara, without that. Pancha Koshatmaka, body is Bhuvanam, Bhuvanam, Jagat. Why it is called Bhuvanam? Bhavanti Asmin Bhutani Iti Bhuvanam. Bhavanti, reside, abide, there are, word Asmin, that in which Bhu, Bhutani. Bhutani means Either can be living beings or Panchamahuda. Both here, both. So that is what is called Bhuvana. Chakasiki, is it perceived? This is not a question. This is what is called as a yes, practical way of speaking. Kaku prayog means it doesn't, is not perceived. Why did you do that? What does it mean? Told. Why did you do that? You should not ask that. You should not have done it. That is just the change of tone, changes the meaning of the sentence. So that, so that means the case here. Acoustic. Is it perceived? This answer is what? It is not perceived. It is not perceived. So therefore, tad, tad means here, tasma. Etat pancha vidham deham vina. Vina, vidham. Etat deham, this body. What body? Pancha vidham. Fivefold. Fivefold means made up of five sheets. Adnamaya to Anandamaya post. Pancha deham vina. Keva Bhuvanam Pashanti. Please tell me who and who really perceive the world. From you, the Panchakoshashnaka Jagat is removed. You have no more the embodiment having the five five pujas. Come on, perceive the world. Will you be able to? No, come on, tell me why not. To see, eyes are not there. To hear, ears are not there. To smell, nose is not there. To taste, tongue is not there. Touch is there. To come to the glass, legs are not there. <laughs> legs are not there. So that is what? Can you, Madantu, come on, please tell me if this Panchakoshatmaka body is not there. Who is going to perceive the Jagat means no one can perceive the Jagat. So therefore, so long as identification with the body is there, mere presence of body may not, is not sufficient. A Jnani has got the body, but he is absorbed as a Rupa, no more identification with the body, no interaction with the body. 
even something happens to the body, he is not aware of. See, Ramakrishna Paramahamsa was suffering from cancer. He knows too much. But when he was in Samadhi, he was not feeling the feeling. He was not aware of that body. Suppose a cancer patient sleeps. Has he got the pain? pain? No. Why? No identity with the body. So you identify with the body, all the features of the body will be vividly experienced by you. <coughs> now pain belongs to who? Hunger, thirst belongs to who? Only childhood belongs to who? The restlessness, agitation belongs to who? Mind. Do you experience all these things? Means you are identifying with these at, at different levels at different times. No identification. Presently what? Sleep. Yes. At our present level, no identification with the body means sleep. But sleep is not Neither you are asleep, nor you are identified with the body. Do you know where you are? You not don't say Samadhi. You are what you are. You are what you are. Because with the present status of yours, with the person of the world, you say Samadhi. What is Samadhi? The Dhi, Buddhi, which is Sama. Not Vishama. Do you know the Vastu, the entity that is there in the creation, which is Sama, is what is that? Brahma Chaitanya. Sama, Avikari, unchangeable. What is a Vikari or a Savikari? Changeable. If you are subject to change. Mind, Indriyas, change. Pranas, Barish Girgaya, Bhuki Nahi. So change. But that which is without change, always without. What is it? Always, what you mean by always? Oh. In your life, always. Don't tell me 24 by 7. <laughs> Confine it. Yes, you, the individual, you are undergoing three states of consciousness. Making state, Dream state and this is fine. Waking state predominantly you are identified with the physical body. Of course, mind is there, there. but predominantly you are identified with the physical body. In the dream, no physical body. You are totally identified with the subtle body. In the sleep, neither the subtle body. Not the physical body, you are identified with the formed body. Now tell me, you are all at present all experiences, are they not in these three categories? Do you experience now anything beyond the realm of making dream and deep this state? No. That is always means what? Waking, deep, and then now you bring your 24 by 7. Now you bring your 24 by 7. Now in all these things, except this what deep state, Bodham is there or not? Now suppose you are not asleep at your present level, what should be the condition? 
either you are in the dream identified with the Suksha Sarira or you are in the waking state identified with the Suksha Sarira. Is there other way, uh, other way out for you? Suppose you are neither sleeping nor dreaming nor awake. What can be the condition? Is it possible ever? Yes or no? It is possible. That is what you are for. Supposed to accomplish through Veda. Veda is meant for that. What state it can be? Look. Waking state, Vikari. Dream state, Vikari. Deep sleep state also Vikari. Priya Moda, Pramoda, Kutti, Sartha. And you are going, coming out of that. Now, are you aware of these changes? Are you aware of waker, waking body, waking world, waking experiences? Are you aware of or not? Yes. We experience or not? Yes. Okay? Is a dream? Are you aware of dreamer, dreamt world, dream, dream experiences? Yes or no? Yes. In sleep, were you aware? of absence of all these things or not? Yes. Means there is an entity because of which you are aware of waking, dream and deep day and that principle should necessarily be free from from what? Waking and all paraphernalia, dream and all accomplishing and uh, sleep with all ignorance. In that, neither the Panchaposhas are there, nor the Indriyas are there, nor the waking world is there, nor the dream world is there, nor the sleep is there. Accepted? What is that? If you are in that, neither you are in the where? The sleep, nor in the Making at the dream, such a state is that it is called Tuliya Avasna. An exclusive state wherein you are what you are. Free from physical body, subtle body, causal body. It is called as what? Tuliya Avastha, Pandukya Upanishad, Seventh Mantra. None of these are there. None of what? Speaking one word of two? So what is there is that? Chaitanya and Chaitanya alone, wherein you are ignorance, no causal body means, no ignorance also, what you are, not you can't say face to face. You only don't say ah, is. <laughs> you only wherein you are not asleep, you are not awake, you are not dream. To say this is your Swarupa. Otherwise, you are identified with the Pasha Kosha. So, in this Sarupa, no Pasha Koshas, no identification, no waking, no dream, no sleep. That is what? Madam, please tell where is the word? Keva Bhuvanam Pashanti. Who can perceive the word? Please tell me so what no one can perceive. Now tell me, is this something away from you? 
is this something that Captain Kailasa or Kedar Badrina? What is this principle? Chaitanya. That Chaitanya was pointed out in its exclusive state in the Turiya Vasta. Do you mean to say in the waking dream and this is said that Chaitanya is not there? In the waking you perceive the Jagat because of our Indriyas. Indriyas coming in contact with the sense of them. But who enables those Indriyas to perceive? We have to say to begin with Chidavasa, a Chidavasa is nothing but in the dream state, you are aware of the dream world. How are you aware of them? Through the vrittis, thoughts in the dream. What makes you experience those thoughts? Same awareness principle, Chaitanya. In sleep, you experience, at that time you may not know, your antakaran to express is not there. On waking up you know, I slept well, I don't know, I didn't know anything. Who made it this? This there was ignorance, and the ignorance was made known by who? Chaitanya. But in Turiya Vasa, that Chaitanya alone is there, these all things are. Means in the waking dream and this is the that Turiya Chaitanya is there or not? Yes. Is there, but coupled with? All Upadis and all things. So our Swarupa is free from that. Our Samsara is where now? Come on. What is Samsara? Limited existence. Where, where do we experience it? Waking, dream, and this is it. In Turiya Vasta, Samsara cannot be there. Why cannot be there? Jagat is what you are, what you are, what you are. So that means without body you can't pursue the Now what is going to be told like this. See, this Jagat is projection of the mind. How exactly you encountered the world? How you perceive the world? Through the mind. But this mind is what? Dependent on uh, the eye notion. What is the eye notion? Taking the body as I. So therefore, entire jagat, mind depends on where? I. You identified what was told earlier, being over, is going to be proved now. You identify with the body. Jagat, no identification, no Jagat. You may have the body as a Jnani, lost in the Swarupa, but no Jagat. Why? No Arandhi, no identification. So the Pantavan says, this entire Jagat is nothing but projection of the mind. Mind is there, Jagat is there. Mind is not there, Jagat is not there. Continue. Shabdadi Rupam Bhuvanam Samastam Shabdadi Rupam Bhuvanam Samastam Shabdadi Satte Indriya Vrutti Bhasya Shabdadi Satte Indriya Vrutti Bhasya Satte Indriya Nama Indriya Vrutti Bhasya 
इंद्रिया सत्ता मनसा वशे सदुवन मनोमय पता वन Without the body, you can't perceive the jagat. So I say that jagat is projection of your mind. This is really speaking from Hiranyagar onwards until your body, nothing is there except what <coughs> projection of the mind. Actually, it started at Hiranyagar. योग समस्त शब्दादि रूप एवरी स्टेटमेंट यू हैव टू यू मेड अ स्टेटमेंट व्हाट इज इट एंटायर जगत इज ऑफ द नेचर ऑफ शब्द स्पर्श रूप Do you explain something? Oh, it was too hard, and then I drank a glass of cool lassi inside my stomach. It was cool. Come on, tell me which of these shabdas per se are per se ganda? ग्लास <laughs> What is happening inside the stomach? Burning. How do you know? Sparsha. <laughs> This sparsha. Internal sparsha. Internal sparsha. Then who the see what that is what? Internal sparsha. Internal sounds also. Ah, so you see, I am a doctor. This fellow is suffering from typhoid, and in the stethoscope. All blasts and bombarding things are going on. They they hear the sound like bombarding thing. So that is such a thing. Thing is going in the stomach. So inside also what? Shabda sparsha upara sa ganda rupa. You will not be able to know. Sarjans will be able to know. Sarjans will know the rupa. Shabda shabda sparsha rasa rasa also. जगत Five things, shabda, sparsha. There is nothing called the sixth one. Let us say, bhuvanam, samastam bhuvanam, shabda adi rupa. Now tell me, yes or no? Still some are doubt. What do you mean by yes? Yes, that is true. My, not my statement. Whose statement? Ramana Maharshi. So he says, entire jagat is shabdas par shabd upar sada put together, external or internal. Accepted. Now you tell me, you now you tell me, how do you know shabdas par shabd upar sada? 
शब्दायु रूप स्पर्शायु रूपायु रसायु टेस्ट गंधायु विद हेल्प ऑफ वॉट विदउट ज्ञानेन्द्रिय विदउट सेंस इन दर्गन कैन यू परसिव शब्द स्पर्श रूप जगन इज रिड्यूस टू शब्द स्पर्श रूप शब्द स्पर्श रूप रिड्यूस टू वॉट पंच ज्ञानेन्द्रिय शब्दादि सत्ता इंद्रियादि इंद्रियादि भाष्य शब्द स्पर्श रूप रसगंध आर मेड नोन टू यू बाय व्हाट इट सपोज देयर इज अ 10 पर्सन वन फिफ्थ ऑफ द वर्ल्ड इज आउट फॉर इट व्हिच वर्ड इट इज शब्द देयर इज अ ब्लाइंड पर्सन द वर्ड ऑफ रूप इज Temporarily, when you get a cold, <laughs> the world of smell goes for you. Is it not? You drank steaming hot coffee for four days. What? No, no, just a half taste. Is it not? Then the Shabda de Satta Indriya Vritti Bhasya. इंद्रियस प्रोड्यूस द विषयाकार अंतकरण वृत्ति विदाउट अ विषयाकार अंतकरण वृत्ति प्रोड्यूस बाय हु इंद्रियस व्हाट शब्दादि इज नॉट देयर शब्दादि आर नॉट देयर इन जगत इज नॉट सो नाउ जगत इज डिपेंडेंट ऑन हु इंद्रिय प्रवृत्ति द इंद्रिय वृत्ति इज डिपेंड ऑन हु यू आर लिसनिंग शब्दाकार वृत्ति You see, rupa kar ruti, what level? Mental level. These are all mano ruti. So that is indriya nam satta manasaha vashesha sya. Indriya nam satta existence of mind is where under the control of who? No, yeah, yeah, mind, mind. Okay. Now look here. Minds project the indriya vrittis. Indriyas provide that, and with that they reveal the jagat. Jagat depends on who now. Mind. That is why when you are exposing to Vedanta teaching, your mind goes for a walk. What happens? No wrong. Nothing wrong with you. Are here. You are not in the position to hear. जगत What manomayam? It is the projection of the mind. So don't say bhuvanam is what is it, <coughs> including your heaven and hell, including heaven and hell. Whatever you cognize in the realm of God, whatever you, you miss with the. Ident the entity identified with the embodiment is the bhuvanam patam. So therefore, without the body, you can't perceive the world. Or perceiving the world, what is necessary finally is mind. Now this mind depends on who. Mind projects the world in terms of. मनोमया वृत्ति इस कॉरेस्पोंडिंग टू विशेष और वो डर दिस माइंड डिपेंड सेस अहंकार आई वृत्ति सी आई लिसन आई हियर आई आई हियर आई सी आई ईट आई वॉक आई परसीव आई टेस्ट I smell, I touch. 
what you see is different from what you hear. What you hear is different from what you smell. What you smell is different from what you touch. But who is called entity? Well, I, 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 I. This I it is not Chaitanya, I, not Atma. I. Identified with the apartment. If the I, this I is removed, where are Ruthis? Those, if you remember, Upadesha Sara Pramana Marji. Vritta Yastvam Vritti Masita. Vritta Yastvam Shabda Sparsha Rupa Rasa Ganda Adi Vritta Yastvam Aham Vritti Masita. They depend on what? Aham Vritti, what is the Aham Vritti? I know. Generally, the example is given like this. Big, big contractors, construction, real, construction, bridge, etc. They hire the laborers. On what basis? Daily wages. Daily the laborers come and go, come and go, come and go, come and go. But there is one supervisor there who keeps account of that, who pays them, etc., etc. He doesn't come and go. He's always like that, Aham uh, Ji is a supervisor. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> all these Ruttis coming and going are daily labor. Is that correct? Jagat without the embodiment cannot be perceived. To perceive what is necessary, Shabda Adi Rupa. For Shabda Adi Rupa, what is necessary? The Indriya the Indriya is necessary. Indri Rutti. For Indriya Ruttis, mind is necessary. So that's why Jagat is reduced to our projection of the mind. Now he says, this mind is dependent on Ahadhi, entire Jagat is product of projection of Ahadhi. Thank you. <laughs> Ujeti, 
राइजेस इज बॉर्ड विथ वॉर्ड अहमदी वेरीफाई होते कैन यू वेरीफाई आई विल टेल यू वेन टू वेरीफाई टूडे यू गो हो यू टू आफ्टर द क्लास अहंकार Me, you may not spend out. Me, then, oh, today Monday, office go down. <laughs> office go down. So the urgent work is there. Half an hour early, I have to go. So and all the need is today, etc. So just straight away there, basic. Oh, shit. So now first thing, what happened? Aha. Uh-huh. Few moments earlier, that Aham was not there, Jagat was not there, and now the Aham has dropped out, Jagat has dropped out of heart. Have to go to office from where Jagat was from, Atma. Atma has no job. Atma has no job. No one can be employed also. We just want to keep that to say. Sanyasi is unemployed and unemployable. <laughs> अरे यार आज संडे है क्लास भी नहीं है Just now, I'm the surveyor. It's whatever. God, very jagat. Now what does God say? Do ka ha ahandhya sa udeti. It rises with the I notion. Ahandhi is what I get with body. I notion. Then. When in sleep, ahankar goes, jagat also is what? No more there. Now tell me now, who reveals you the jagat? <coughs> ahankar. Ahankar is that? Maybe. Ahankar is making use of Mind, mind is making use of indriyas. Indriyas are are housed where in the body, all accepted, but taken for granted. Body is there, indriyas are there, jagat is there, ahankara is not there. Where that are jagat? So, oh. so therefore, entire jagat where center of the whole. Therefore, it says, "Go on." Tata ha. Therefore, esha ha. Esha means this loka, jagat. Me pravibhasya. It is revealed to you. It is made known to you by what? The, with the, with not with the, with the, ah, with the, I know. Now, you want to keep the world intact or get out of it? Think properly. Okay. If you are not able to decide, next time you tell me. <laughs> I will give you one one week period to think over. Do you want to keep the world or 
Andy. Andy. Sure. If you end the world, you know what will happen? So what will happen? Well, you want to end, okay? I you want to end it. Why you study Vedanta? This so-called world truly is not there. But appears every moment. It is the source of our what is called as samsa. What we want is what we want in life: happiness, freedom from sorrow, freedom from death, freedom from ignorance. So long as this world is there, it is next to impossible. Why? The basis of Jagat is what you see. And that basis of Jagat is what you are in reality. All that Vedanta aims is to make you discover what you are in reality. In the wake of it, no Jagat, no Samsara, nothing to be. You can't say, no, 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 Jagat bhi chahiye or Atma bhi chahiye. God's speed and things. Oh, thank you. Means what? For the time being, Vedanta is good. So, I did that in a tapa de kao or rapa sao. Tabi ho, tabi ho. Bhagwan keeps tapa steady. You will hear about a software, you know. <laughs> software. You are all prana de karma. That's what. Any ups and downs in life are because of what? Rather of the software. We may not know it. We may refuse to access. Just it. Accept it and take to remedial measures. In your non-acceptance, you are aggravating the problem. You know, a very interesting example is there from Mahabharata. Dronacharya was in the form and said, I'm going to destroy all the and the fight was going And one stage, he was, he sent what is called as Narayana Astra. Really dreaded Astra. First thing is, the opponent fighter cannot detect it is Narayana Astra. Because Astra says, design means, First, you should identify and then counter missile you have to see. Suppose, Agni Astra, you send Varuna Astra. Naga Astra, send Varuna Astra. So, like that is it. So, that is it. That is what happened in the who fight between Arjuna and Karna. That day, Krishna sought away. Arjuna's carrot was fully lubricated. And oil can, oil can also be kept. Because he knew Karana is going to send the Agni Astra and Arjuna has to contract with what? Varuna Astra. Varuna Astra is what? Downpour, rain. And what will happen? It will not tar road. All muck was there. And what Lord Krishna did? Because Karana is chasing who? Arjuna. Krishna saw to it that his Arjuna chariot was driven through all Maya. He couldn't say whatever he was just saying, he got caught up. That was the wheel, wheel got caught up in the earth, he could not receive the So then, now the Narayana Asra was difficult to receive. And you should know how to retaliate. Only Krishna detected it. Pandavas were not aware of it. Immediately he said, all Pandavas, get down from the chariot and with a folded hand stand still. All got down except Bhima. <laughs> Why should I? 